Welcome back to the Voice of Saints. Today we celebrate the feast of Saint Matilda. Saint Matilda was born about 895, the daughter of Count Dietrich of Westphalia and Reinhild of the Royal House of Denmark. She was raised by her grandmother, the Abbess of Erfurt, at her convent, where she developed skills in needlework and purposeful living as well as a taste for prayer and spiritual reading. She was married to Henry, Duke of Saxony, and called the Fowler because of his interest in falconry, who became the King of Germany in 919. Henry encouraged Matilda to use the resources of his kingdom for works of charity. They had two daughters, Gerberja, who married Louis IV of France and Hedwig, the mother of Heck Capet, as well as three sons, Otto, who succeeded his father in 936 and became Holy Roman Emperor, Henry, who became Duke of Bavaria, and Bruno, who became Archbishop of Colin. Immediately after Henry died in 936, Matilda called for the priest to say mass for his soul and at the same time took off all the jewels she wore and handed them over to the priest as a pledge that she would give up the things of the world from then on. She lived as a widow for 32 years. During this time, she suffered ill treatment from her son Otto, who was annoyed that in the election for the king, she favoured his younger brother, Henry. Henry called the quarrelsome, revolted against his brother and also showed himself ungrateful to his mother. Both complained of their mother's generosity to the church and to the poor. Matilda transferred her inter inheritance to her sons and retired to a convent she had built. Matilda built many churches and founded many monasteries. She died in 968 at the monastery at Quedlinburg, where she had buried Henry and was interred with him there. Reflection O oh God, by whose grace that Saint Matilda enkindled with fire of thy love, became a burning and a shining light in thy church. Grant that we may be inflamed with the same spirit of discipline and love, and ever walk before thee as children of light, through Jesus Christ our Lord. On behalf of Saints Fans Association, I wish you all a happy feast. Amen.